it's Megan Kane here to bring you our very first edition of Sports Rewind. Every Friday I will tell you what happened in sports during the past week and tell you what events to look forward to. Monroe Varsity Football beat Pioneer 31-0 last Saturday afternoon. Jacob Blosser ran for two touchdowns along with an Adavion Billingsley receiving touchdown. Monroe plays rival Bedford tonight at 7 p.m. where they will compete for the Golden Cleat Award. The annual varsity contest winner receives a trophy and keeps it at their school for the remainder of the year. JV beat Bedford last night 28-12, ruining the rival's undefeated streak. Owen Yaunt scored a couple of touchdowns, as did Ryan Sealer and Aiden Brody. JV plays at Chelsea next Thursday at 6.30 p.m. The freshmen also beat Bedford 20-8, leaving them undefeated this season. JV soccer lost 6-0 to Celine on Monday. JV played Skyline for their final game on Tuesday. Varsity lost 3-0 to Celine on Monday. They came back and tied Skyline 1-1 on Tuesday. Monroe played Districts last night versus Bedford and won 6-0. The Monroe volleyball teams played Celine on Tuesday night. Varsity lost 3-0. The girls will play Ann Arbor here on next Tuesday at 7 p.m. The cross country team hosted Adrian at their last homie of the season last Saturday. The Lady Trojans ran to a 15-46 victory. The top three finishers for Monroe were Victoria Blaniars, Bridget Dudley, and Carly Bundin. This Saturday, the team will compete in the SEC Championship at Indian Creek Park. Boys Varsity will run at 9 a.m., Boys JV runs at 10.30, Girls Varsity runs at noon, and Girls JV at 1.30. That's all for this week's Sports Rewind. Tune in again next week for highlights of the Bedford football game. If you have any sports highlights, share them with us. Our email is lotusleaflive1 at gmail.com.